everybody and welcome to Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm Lon McCarran alongside Phil Galfon and welcome to Studio 52, the Las Vegas home of Poker Night in America. Thanks Lon and thanks to the entire Poker Night in America crew. I'm looking forward to another entertaining night of poker. It should be just that. Let's take a look at tonight's starting lineup. In the one seat, self-proclaimed poker socialite Haley Hanna. She appeared on an earlier show on her 30th birthday and won nearly 30 grand. To her left, Christian Soto, a poker commentator for the Hustler livestream, making her Poker Night in America debut in the three seat with three WSOP bracelets and 6.6 .6 million in live tournament earnings. We say hello to Chrissy Foxen. In the four seat, Jared Jaffe. Fun fact, Jared's live tournament earnings 6.5 million. And to no one's surprise, MJ Gonzalez is playing for the sixth time. MJ has yet to book a loss here at Studio 52. However, his last profit was just 100 bucks. Lastly, in the sixth seat, it's Christina McAlpin, an investor and nonprofit consultant who enjoys playing cash in Las Vegas and recently pulled a 50K bounty in a Venetian tournament. Strong lineup here with three 10K buy-ins, three at 20K, and hang with us, we have Christian, Chrissy and Christina, it's gonna be fun. They're both playing really good. And in the box, 2019 WSOP Dealer of the Year, Heather Alcorn, keeping it moving. They're a Jaffe opening up with aces under the gun. I, I just, I'm just gonna get bullied tonight, verbally, and well, you I, I just gotta be okay with it. I just gotta be okay with it. King offsuit for Haley. Wait, Haley, so Hannah, could find trouble here with the ace king. Yes, no. Manages to just call. And avoid preflop disaster. That's his size. That's his size. Right I think you could. I think you might just. You should probably raise them. Maybe. I'll, I haven't looked at my cards yet. Well, what difference does it make if I have 10 deuces? Uh, I'm, I'm scared. I like that you play fast. Jackie? Chrissy plays I fast. Play fast. I like Thank that. You. I like that. <laughs> Me? Yeah. I was good there? Yeah. 2013 good. That's, wow. that's great. Yeah. And top set for way, Jaffe. He could almost yeah, break the game right here. <laughs> Haley with top pair and bottom <laughs> set for Soto. You have me to come back. Yeah. You're on poker night. Yeah. Bad and this is going to be an interesting one. I lost. Haley, who avoided well, I'm here now. getting a lot of money in preflop in bad shape. It's going to be hard to avoid it now. Because bet, call, call. Yeah, Nobody raising yet, at least. <laughs> Uh, because Normally, when you have ace ace on an ace high flop, it's hard for anybody else to have much. Thank you. A lot of times, people will slow play aces. Thank you. Traffic continuing to bet here, and it's going to work out for him. You started with 10, right? I might have like 10 2 or 10 okay. 3 because yeah, yeah, I won I, the prop. Your mom started with 10. <laughs> 36. Right, 3,600. I'm just watching what's happening. Might have a drink. Got the all in. All in. Haley with a huge decision. Mm -hmm. For Haley, she's facing a lot of heat here. And her ace king was looking great. At this point, both players saying, I have ace king beat. Let's see if she believes them. She started with 10K also, but folds. And oh. Soto does make the call. Oh, thank God. Run it twice. Wow. I get 100 for that card. Haley really managed to get off cheap there. You do? Yeah. Thank you. Facing that heavy action. I get 100 for the card. Yeah, I, I get 100 for that card. Yeah. Sorry. Jared sweeps. No such luck for oh, Christian Soto. Right? Obviously. With his pocket deuces. Yeah, we, I'm not counting this. Are you not going to show me how? Oh, for you. I have a set. We're just oh. throwing money around here. Uh, I think it's awkward. And we Thank welcome Christina McAlpin to the game, team. an investor, a nonprofit <laughs> consultant. I guess she coaches team. losing poker players? No, we'll, we'll, do, we'll do a Twitter <laughs> poll. And, and Next whatever, time I just won't wear a shirt. And what, whatever the results of the Twitter poll are, I'll, I'll Venmo or PayPal, whatever, whoever. I'll be off of the bat. Because <laughs> I, I said Google and we we agreed on Google. And then... No, you agreed on Google. Okay. I said originally that we should you, do you win. You win the bet. Here you go. You win. No, dude, <laughs> we're gonna th we're gonna do it the normal way. We're gonna do like where we ask the people. I don't know why you're being so weird about this. Why are you being all weird? I'm distracted uh, by the table talk here, but <laughs> Chrissy Foxen, an excellent player, three betting here with ten nine suited. But you didn't actually Google mint versus aqua, and now you're being a really a, a, a sore loser about it. I just tried to pay. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't want pity money. I want to beat you fair and square. <laughs> I, and you know what? You have to this is them. all about Jared's Maybe shirt color, ladies and we'll gentlemen. See, we'll see what they think. Yeah. Top pair for Chrissy. Oh, wait, I don't know. What's that? Hold on a second. Sorry. 
From the booth, it's looking mint. Don't get me started. Okay. Huh? It's definitely lime. And who doesn't like me? Which is crazy, because I'm trying to be friends. I don't dislike you. I would tell you if I disliked you. Okay. No. Uh, Anthony. I'm going to keep betting with her nine here, thinking it's best. Needs a lot of protection. Haley Hannah has to decide if Chrissy's bluffing and her ace high is good, or if Chrissy has a hand like this and she's got six outs. I was thinking Haley's considering a call. In fact, she comes with the raise to 3,000, perhaps sensing some weakness. Chrissy now only beats a bluff. She makes the call with the best hand. Unconvinced thus far. Haley wants to keep representing. And the nice thing about this 10 for Haley is that if Haley would have been bluffing the turn with a straight draw, a lot of them have gotten there. She fires 3,700. Chrissy with top two, but she only beats a bluff and she knows it. She makes the call and takes down a nice pot. This game's too tough. <laughs> so, we need more people to drink on this. What do you want to eat tonight? I don't know, man. This chair keeps falling. It needs to be something clean. MJ, I had a nice love Milos suited connectors. 7-5 works. Mm -hmm. Milos lunch is on point. Although oh, well, it doesn't really matter because I never actually get the lunch special. I just order f***ing Olive Garden anyway, so may as well go to dinner. Me and the sharks, come on. Shaking crab. King high best for Chrissy here. Shaking crab. You got me. Yeah? Gut shot for MJ. Are they open late? I don't know, that's the question. But Haley with a gut shot of her own, and hers is stronger. She's gonna continue with the call. Mm. Anna hits her best card, her top card. She would have preferred the straight. And after checking, MJ is facing a $200 bet, and this is gonna sucker him in. He was looking to check fold, faced a bet that was too small, decided to pounce, and he's in trouble. Queens up for Haley. MJ's line looks strong. He's going to keep representing it. Haley looks like she wants to call, although we always want to call, don't we? Maybe 10 deuces in her mind. She does call, and a face down fold from MJ. Nice hand, Haley. Unorthodox $200 bet on the turn really worked out for her. You're trying to bluff me, man. I call you every time. You're supposed to say, oh, ace we'll high Wow, that's a ton of action right out of the gate, but don't go anywhere. Plenty more poker from Studio 52 when we return. How would you like to play against the pros on national TV? Download now to play and win. It's absolutely free to play. Back at Studio 52 in Las Vegas, Poker Night in America, Jared doubled up early set of her set explaining his and Christian Soto's numbers. Bomb pot in progress. MJ with pocket tens. Only one over card to the tens in the bunch. It is really tough to be 40% to win the hand free flop six ways. And <laughs> Jared flops a boat to crush. It does. In the bomb pot, it doubles. I knew there was a way. So five, ten, deuce, I win 100. Yeah. Yes. I don't know, 50, I don't know yet. Okay. Um, no, no. We up what did Heather do with all the paint? Man, you guys are gamblers. Chrissy bets top pair. The deuce is on board. A little bit unfortunate for Jared that he's next to act after the better. It's hard to look weak after calling here. Jeez, what does everybody have here? <laughs> MJ called with the overfair. <laughs> Haley with the flush draw. Exactly. That is what's so fun about the bomb pot. Haley with the flush draw she doesn't want to hit. Right. Chrissy, after getting called in three spots, doesn't like her nine anymore. Jared going to go for some value with his full house. MJ with two players left to act behind him still calls. Oh. What are you doing in there, Chris? The bomb pot. I, I mean, I. Have... <laughs> you want to do it. I... The bomb pot's fun. It's fun. <laughs> Haley, lucky to miss her flush. Jaffe, very strong player, well known in the poker world. <laughs> he reaches for chips and MJ folds. I had a nine. I had a nine. I flopped, I don't know what they had. He had a 
two, I think. You had a more than a two, Chrissy. No, no you did not. not have a bluff. Of course not. You had a two. Well, oh, bomb yeah. pot yeah. redux. I, have a nine. I, I don't remember. Top didn't show, I don't remember. He had a boat of some sort. Oh, Haley flops a set of nines. Soto was open ended. Christina flops top pair and is two percent. Putting chips to work, 300. It's checked all the way to Christina, and Haley has to decide how she wants to navigate this with her set. She raises right away, forcing Christian Soto out of the pot with his open ender. Hmm. <laughs> King of Hearts on that turn. Check. Now, Christina, 8%. You think your hand is good here when you have kings and tens. As we can see, it is not. Christina goes from 2% to 100% with tens full. This is what dreams are made of in poker. And Haley now with the full house herself needs to decide if she wants to put more in. Just calls. That's Probably. Yeah, gets the bad news. Oh Haley with just nines full. That is very unlucky. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. That's, that's a cool one. So do I. No, you're getting. <laughs> no, you're no I wouldn't bet it, against bro. myself. You're start. Oh, okay. McAlpin under the gun with it's two red kings. Great time too. It's like right before WSOP. I thought Haley might boycott nines, but here she is, nines and sevens. Ace king also not facing very heavy action. Gotta like his hand. I keep getting this literal hand back to back. Start playing it. I did earlier. And Christina with kings. How does she want to navigate this? Just call, go three way to the flop, or put in the four bet. See if you can get a lot of your stack in now. Raise. Three raise. She does four bet. Ooh. Right? Well, JJ comes along. Stacks are relatively deep here. 16,000 to start the hand for Christina. Mm. Jared covers. A set for Christina. Top pair of Broadway draw. <laughs> Jaffe. Check. Both players liking this flop. I like this bet size from Christina. You do have to charge your opponent. Jaffe, of course, coming along with the ace king. And a queen. Jared gets there. This is the worst card Christina could have seen, not just because Jared happens to have ace king this time, but she's very often gonna be up against an ace. Christina, quite the outdoors person, pickleball climbing Check. by Jared. You can just look and say, rarely does he get outdoors. Third spade might save her a little bit. Yeah, with the four straight on the board, the three flush, Jared puts out a big bet here. She knows she only beats a bluff. Okay. Bet. Not huge. Still though, what could he be betting for value that's worse than a set on this board? She probably knows what that bet means. <laughs> she just can't ignore it though. Should I call? I fold. Oh, fold. No, she can. Great, great fold. Yeah. Uh, Jerry, you want me on? Great play by Christina in losing that pot. Well, by my count, that is three flop sets that has now lost significant pots this evening, Phil. And I've just been informed by a somewhat questionable <laughs> source that Christina's Riverfold marks just the third time a flop set of Kings has been beaten over 10 seasons of Poker Night. Wow. The way things are going tonight, I would not be surprised if it happened again. Back with more Studio 52 and Poker Night in America when we return. Like Back at Studio 52, Jared up over 18K, Chrissy up over six, oh. Haley and Christian Soto, well, they've got time to turn it around. I've, I've banned them now. Masseuse yes. is at the table. Yes. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start ordering cookies to your, to your place. <laughs> no, please. Yeah. Jared Jaffe, I'm gonna, pocket I'm pair, you and a raise. I'm super lethargic for the World Series. That's fair. You guys are going to be just like jacks for well, Christina. World Series is when She'd it started, like to play for more. So mm -hmm. that, like, whatever, midnight. And these two will clash again. Happy, I call. Yeah. 1,500 in the pot. 1097, draws abound. 
Yeah, this is an action flop for these two hands. I know me either. I want ten deuce. Have you? Have you got ten deuce? No. Goes check bet call. Relatively tame thus far. Yeah, I know you flopped the set. Another seven. What can you do? Set's no good. No more. No, no more set. Oh, yeah. Yeah, nine that actually kills Christina's straight draw, which comes home on the river. A boat for Jared Jaffe. The way the hand's played out, it looks like Christina has a hand like ace-king. So I agree with Jared betting rather than going for a check raise. As we could see, check raise might have worked out nicely. They got her again. The masseuse still working on MJ. Mm. Don't have a clock going on that, but looks like he's got some real problems with that left shoulder. These high rails will get you. Soto's raise is called by two players. Call. Call. Nobody with a, an amazing hand, but... Tracy gets top pair. Enough to see a flop. Fours melt away. Oh, gets a free card, though. Another 10. Trips now for Chrissy Fox, then. And this could get Christian in a little bit of trouble. When there are two over cards and one of them pairs, it's less likely your opponents have one of those. Lots of draws available for Chrissy to be betting with here. Hmm. Did Chrissy's flop check get her paid there, maybe? I think it's more about the queen jacks and the king jacks and the jack eights and the flush draws that could be in there. And she goes for the big over bet. I like this bet. This is solver approved, and I think it's gonna work out pretty well in practice too. Christian Soto just with fours, but he knows he's either crushed or up against a bluff. Does get the call. It was that or the other thing. Listen, Christian. Thank you. Good call, Christian. MJ still hates me. I was asking where you were. He could not be less amused by anyone else at the table, but that's fine. <laughs> nah, he's just got his poker face, huh? <laughs> What poker face? Oh, what are you talking about? He, he bought it for the, like, what was the cap? He bought it for everything. Oh, wow. Yeah, I was like, should I go for it? If it was $100, I don't think I would there's a cap at all. It is Interesting. It's Jackie has been relatively in line this whole time. Three betting, 7 6 offsuit against Christian's early position open. You were the one who raised. She made top Three players. I had a very bad hand. Christina cold calls the ace king suited. Dude, if I had Jared four, I with the middle pair and a good shot. <laughs> manages to find himself in a good position against these two stronger hands pre flop. Haley tried to buy it. Picks up some additional outs. She's going to keep telling her story. This time with a very small bet for the size of the pot. Fold. Mm. He gets it done right away. He does. Ooh, bubbles. I was going to be in trouble. I was going to lose. Oh, oh. We will be right back after these messages with more from Studio 52 Cash Game Action in Las Vegas. Closed captioning is brought to you as a public service by Poker Night in America. Welcome back to Las Vegas, Nevada and Studio 52, where we have seen an unusually high number of big hands and coolers, which, as it turns out, makes for a pretty fun evening for the viewers. Jared and Chrissy, the only earners so far here at Studio 52, Christian and Haley, the big givers. Do you do massage at the table, Phil? You know, if the session's been going on long enough, yeah. Is that right? Yeah. No. Do you have a stop chip with a masseuse, or if you start running bad, do you get rid of it? No, no, no? I, don't, okay. I don't believe in that. Good for you. Haley opens with ace 10. Foxen, Kings. Chrissy Foxen's reputation as a tough player got her overbet paid off. Her reputation might work for her here as well if she comes with the cold four bet. Oh, MJ. <laughs> About the worst hand to have here. I mean, of course, why wouldn't he be in there? Come on. Wow, I'm out of there. 4,400. Okay. Christian, man. I, I, I had a good hand. <laughs> you f***ed up, man. You had a good hand, I feel like. Did we? Okay, meanwhile, all these dogs f***ing dark. Both players about 30,000 deep or more. This is a lot of money behind. Keep in mind, this is a four bet 
from Chrissy, a five bet from MJ. Here comes the dog. Family came came with us last time, and you know what? I like this just call from Chrissy. By the time you put in the six bet, it's really tough to get value from weaker hands, despite only losing to one hand. Wow, King King still ahead, but that ace makes it fun. He's, he's such a natural habitat. He just is like whatever. Like I'm lifted, I see the cards. Really uncomfortable spot now for Chrissy because. If MJ were bluffing pre-flop, he would often have an ace, something like ace four suited, maybe ace five off suit if he's really getting after it. She can't go anywhere yet. It's that small bet she just calls. Usually as MJ, you don't want to turn queens into a bluff here, but his instincts have led him in the right direction before. Let's see. Just over 12K in the pot, he bets 43.75. He is turning this hand into a bluff. Some other good things might happen. You might get called by a flush draw that you're ahead of. But Chrissy can't be liking this spot with kings. MJ, you making Chrissy work. <laughs> She's gonna lay it down, I don't blame her. And uh, great instincts once again for MJ. No 10 deuce, no show. To bluff with a hand that people usually if wouldn't I bluff show with. show you, everyone's gonna ask to see it, so. Great hand by MJ. No. Just show, just Always. show, be a nice guy. Sorry. I have zero problems with Who's anybody. Fire? Period. Uh, no, I do. I'm just, so I'm just trying to be just, like, fun. Have, have a little fun in the stream, can you it's not? not? It's not really fun for me. Nope. It's not fun for you? I mean, you're crushing me. What, what, what are you talking about? I have not I have, I have won a pot off of you at all. Not one. And that's fine. And I, it's, it's all good. I'm not bullying anyone at the table. I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay, first off, Jared no suited. one said that you're bullying anyone at the table. If anyone, like, I'm just like, MJ I'm just suited. so, you know. But we can have a little fun at the table, no, for the stream? And each of them decides to race. Yeah, gonna, like, like, a cold four bet for MJ. Like, about the table. Like, yeah, I, first off, I'm like down like 10K, so I think that Jared we Jeffy with a nice hand to call yeah, four bet I, with. I apologize, yeah. yeah. I mean, you bought him for the, for the max. And like, stacks here are deep once cool. again. Okay. I'm being, I, I feel like I'm actually being super nice to you. I, oh no, not for you, just him. Bottom pair best for Jaffe here. MJ with a draw, seemingly as usual. Standard continuation bet here, and against this sizing, you can't really get rid of 8-7 with a backdoor flush draw just yet. But Jared's not loving it. I just can't believe I showed up and got Jared. a Jared, adds a flush I'm draw. I'm awesome. liking it a little bit more now. Let's see if MJ wants to keep bluffing with his gut shot. Like, I, get, I, get, I get bad play anxiety. I would never fly private, and I would never fly in a helicopter ever in my life. No, MJ rivers Jared. With enough streets, MJ will often beat you. He finds the value bet. Not scared of the ace. <laughs> Good fall for Takes it down. That's the queen of diamonds. I will take diamond. 100, sir. That's Thank a queen you. of diamonds. Still with the masseuse, but MJ has a long way to go to beat Phil Ivey, who would get a massage through entire main event days back in the day. Yeah, you think those days are long for the players. Exactly. Chrissy raising up, a six suited. A little bit of a loose call from MJ, but we've seen a bit of that before. Christina with the same, loose call with a three he's suited. Number two, nice, he's, he's, he's close. I'm gonna raise. Hmm. Mm. 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 Right. Christian not Chris suited. Nice. <laughs> He's gonna three bet with the kings. <laughs> Lays it down. Ace five, ace four suited. A good bluffing hand there, but ace six not having that straight draw. Oh. Haley, who does have that ace four suited, she wants to see a slop. Fold, fold, fold to Haley. In my drunk compadre. We're both mm -hmm. I mean, we're out of buried. We're, we're here. We're Literally doing. buried we're so much. It. Haley we're started this hand with 11,000. Buried are we right now? Christian covers. Bet 1,000. <coughs> Got about five times pot remaining. Still relatively is deep. Is she staring at me? Is there, is there, is there, is there I'm staring at you, man. Is there a I'm zoom Haley in. flops middle pair. Top kicker, backdoor flush draw, backdoor straight draw. Staring's not nice. <laughs> I'm not trying to be a d No, no, I know, I know. Normally be a relatively standard check call. She okay. does find the call. Okay. 
Eight of Hearts turn might slow things down. Christian decides to check it back. And Haley now just a weak pair. A straight draw has come in. The flush draw has come in. Does she want to bluff with it? She does. Christian not buying. Yeah. Kings. Kings? Mm -hmm. Kings good. Christian won a nice pot. Haley Hanna gets her hand caught in the cookie jar once again. We'll see if Haley can pick a better spot when we return to Studio 52 here in Las Vegas. Welcome back to Poker Night in America from Studio 52 in Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm Lon McCarran alongside Phil Galfon. Somehow here at Studio 52, MJ has climbed into the green, and Haley and Christian, who just played that last hand, are both down 11K plus. I'm down. You're, you're up in the so it's fun. I'm losing. That's great. So that's what people are doing? So he yeah. well, well, I mean, you're the you only person buying for yellow chips. You could also, you could also, um... What are you doing? Joy Christian, yeah. did you buy in for yellow chips? Because I was. I no, I didn't. I have to bully you too. MJ's in with deuces. Like I'm, I'm, I'm losing. Like no, I'm just, I'm no, just, just new one. Okay. I tried to open up one. Also, and never went down for she one. likes these little suited cards. Oh. Okay. She's not the only one. Haley trying to get healthy with King Nine. <laughs> it's not for me. Probably not. I've like turned them on like twice. And Christina, yeah. flop the joint. Sorry, am I the button or am I the small line? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm the button. Oh, no, I think I was the small button. Fortunately for her, Check. there's a very strong second best hand here. Yep. MJ's bottom set. Christian Soto checks his gut shot. MJ on the button. Wants some value with his set. And I like this fast play from McAlpin. It's a draw heavy board. If you check call, you can lose your action on a lot of turn cards. And there are a lot of draws you could be semi bluffing with as well. Oof. Unfortunately for her, her hand is no longer best as MJ turns the full house. Hard for her to put him on that. She's got to still be liking her 6 3. Christina drawing dead to a power outage here in the studio. Usually when you don't get raised, you expect to be good there, but MJ with bottom full house, didn't feel like putting some more in. Yeah. What do you consider it? Valley's Paris. Okay. Horseshoe, no? What is it? Is it horseshoe? Horseshoe? Yeah. Oh, it is? Oh, so whoa. I don't understand, they bought Valley's? Uh, or? They just changed the name because of the oh. MJ Gonzalo's reaching, what's he got? Wow. Not much. Okay, 10-6. <laughs> He's got the button now. Haley Hanna's got a dominated 8-6 as they head to the flop, just the two of them. <laughs> a gut shot. He's got a diamond. And I like this continuation bet. And Haley, you'd expect to fold here, but Haley surprises us once again. Just the pure float, out of position, eight high, no draw. Haley really wants MJ's chips. She does. MJ, gonna keep firing. And now what can you do out of position with eight high? You do pick up the diamond draw, but check calling the turn with eight high doesn't really work. I think if she wants to continue, it's gotta be with a raise, but it's a very wild play, to say the least. MJ, of course, bluffing himself. Mm, there is the raise. And Haley's bluff beats MJ's bluff. Props to Haley. Nice <laughs> hand. <laughs> wow. I don't want to catch any strays. If he didn't have a spade, he probably would have folded. That part is true. I'm, yes. Whose big blind is it? Raise, <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to raise us with the sevens? Wow, Haley, I guess, with a new recipe to play? success. I did play. Yeah, well, you didn't want to play. Because I can't even remember my I first put in the small raise here on the button with a very weak hand. I'm literally just drawing dead. Oh, here you go. She's going to all the She can't be she expecting wants, this to get a fold preflop, but she does manage to get it heads up. She's out for blood. Jared's still best with the sevens. He checks. Don't look at Haley's cards. It really doesn't matter at this point, it seems to her. 
Doesn't matter to her, but if we reach showdown, it'll matter. Jared not going anywhere. He is still best. Picks up a gut shot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Haley, no pair, no draw, one over card. She's going to keep telling her story as she often has here at Studio 52. Jared with another call, and his real decision will come on the river if she puts him to the test once again. Jaffe with another check. It looks like Haley is going to try one more time. Jaffe perhaps having flashbacks to folding middle pair and got shot to Haley's bluff on the turn earlier. Oh, calling chips in hand. He looks like he wants to call. And he's going to. One last drink for a dying poker player. And nice try. It turned out Haley's cards finally did matter. There at showdown, she gets caught. A good relationship. Wow, I found $100. Yeah, we They're do. like we do. a god and goddess <laughs> of poker. Aww. I'm all in. Haley, under the gun, king queen, all in. Uh, now I'm down to 3,300 after that last hand. <laughs> Still quite a lot to open shove. Good Come luck. On, give me some action. Jason, give her action with sixes. Give me some of that Perkins action. I can't action believe someone really. called. Gorge is going to call. He's backed. Can I stop? And we've got a flip. Oh, How many times do you want? I don't care. It's up to you. I don't ever choose, so your call. Um, I'll do twice. Two. Yeah. I'll do twice. We're gonna run it twice. Good luck, Haley. Good luck. It's a mystery. A okay, well, are you going to show your hand? Small pair. That was a bold call. Sixes. Running it twice. King, queen against sixes. And there's a queen. That's it. No, it's you. He has king of clubs. King of clubs. Haley okay. Hannah's still good. MJ looking for one of his two no sixes. Idea. I'm so down by so much. I don't know how much. It's I'm not there. <laughs> this is why I stack it this Deficit way, because I don't know how much I'm down either. <laughs> I, have, I, I have no idea. Another queen Four. in the window that time. Ah, now in the kitchen. There's got to be, there's gotta be a six in the deck. <laughs> Some backdoor straight draws and flush draws for MJ, but nope on this turn. Just needs a six. Haley will take them both. Going right through MJ. Well, that was a much needed double up for Haley Hanna, who is still going pedal to the metal. We'll see if she can stay on track when the Studio 52 from Las Vegas returns. How would you like to play against the pros on national TV? Download now to play and win. It's absolutely free to play. So tonight at Studio 52, so far Jared and Chrissy back to being the only winners. The Losers Lounge uh, SRO right now. Well, Phil, they voted for yet another bomb pot. Let's see a flop. I was hoping I was like, MJ with, with the boat. <laughs> Got everybody drawing near dead. Last act. Doesn't want this flop to check around, so let's see if he can get somebody to put some money in. Nobody has much of anything, but Christina coming in there with the ace high, back to her straight draw. Haley with ace five will donate. Three of the best. Interesting. <laughs> and Haley picking up this flush draw is going to get her in a little bit of trouble. She's improved like I've never As MJ seen continues to bet it. She's like, hmm. I just really, I would Four hearts to a bigger loss. It's probably, I mean, I'm not, probably it's a blessing, not necessarily though. a bad thing. Yeah. But I don't, whenever I play props, like, I'm just, I never have a shot. Thank you. Haley calls. Fortunately for her, she has the ace high flush draw. Oftentimes she'll put in a raise there if she'd floated the flop with a hand like eight, seven of hearts. The lead out with a bet, not quite sure. She's attempting there with the ace. She has some showdown value. But she got crushed. MJ, quick call with the six. 
and he'll take it down. Thank you. Well, because everyone had so much fun with the last bomb plot, here we go again, back to back. Here we go again. Christian, the one to beat with pocket kings, only Haley is suited, and Chrissy steals Christian's thunder with two pair. Oh, wow, two in a row. I like Jeffy with top pair <laughs> fires out of that. That's great. And Christina, no pair, no draw. She's got the king of spades. And did Christian muck the kings? He did. He did. Facing the bet and the raise, it worked. But Chrissy, top and bottom pair. She beats some value bets. And as we can see, she's in great shape against a bluff. Jared not thrilled at all. Chrissy's cold call looks quite strong. He's got to worry about Christina's hand as well. And I think he makes a prudent lay down. Chrissy checks, Christina bets. She's just decided she's going to tell this story. No outs to speak of. Chrissy not loving the ace, but Hard to be convinced just yet when you have queens and deuces. Could you be up against seven deuce for value? Could you be up against ace five of spades for value? That's gonna show it down. Could you be up against a bluff? Again, a bomb pot. You could be up against anything. Christina hasn't shown down many hands where she's gotten out of line. And that is going through Chrissy's mind. And with the best hand she raises. And Christina mucks. Well done, Chrissy B. Because I won't eat it all tomorrow. Yeah. I never eat when I play. Me either. If I'm playing a tournament, like, never I never eat. I don't eat when I'm playing cash or tournaments at all. Soto raises, suited 9-8, and Jared Jaffe welcomes the aces. That's in the small three bed in position. I like that. I'm all in. You heard her. And Haley, with 7-6 offsuit, wants to gamble. What do you want, Haley? <laughs> right? Uh, well, yeah. Running it twice. You're not gonna have a set. Oof. She got part of it. Some hope for Haley. <laughs> uh, hope for Jared. Just don't waste them. Yeah. Okay. Didn't waste it. Pocket aces went to a flush. Now I'll do clubs. Oh, another six for Haley. And, and spades. spades. What on earth? It's Jared got a little greedy asking for another flush. Well, chop it up. And he's drawing slim on this second board. Yeah, chop nice. it up. Good hand. Chop, chop. Chop, chop. Good chop. <laughs> we will be right back after these messages with more from Studio 52 and this great cash game from Las Vegas. I mean, you snap. Back in Las Vegas, poker night in America at Studio 52. The Jaffe and Foxen show continue. Double digit losses mount for Christian and Haley. That second board really did it to me. <laughs> the second board got punished. That second board really yes, did it. Sure. There you go. Haley, no respect for my raise. <laughs> Six, seven, all in. Suited queen for MJ. Of course, that's a raise. Christina calls with a suited connector. Haley with 9 3 offsuit going to come along as well. And Christian's got a nice hand there in the big blind. MJ and the losers. The <laughs> I'm losing. Okay, the losers. All the losers. Christian, the losers. best with top pair. Bottom pair for Christina. Check. Check. There's only two winners of this game. Check. Who? MJ, Who not going to fire out a C bet with a hand like this against three players. Oh. No. The eight brings a couple of draws. And Haley with no outs. Go for it. She's got one call and two folds. You were trying to get MJ. You were trying to get him. You were trying to get him. That's what we're here for. Yeah, no, I mean, yeah. That's what we're here for, right? You were trying to get him. I respect it. Two pair for Christian. I didn't three bet him. Okay, I'm going to. Haley ends up with the nine straight blocker here. Opts not to go for it, she just checks. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
and calls. She must think her hand is something else. Straight. No, you don't have a straight. No? You could, you could actually she take it back. She thought she had a straight. Back. That's fine. Yeah, you don't Christian. Have no, you I called don't. with nine high, yeah. Just take your 600 oh. back. Yeah. No, Giving the bet no, back. No, 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 take your 600 back. You didn't, you didn't mean to man. call with Good that. man, that is, in my opinion, the right thing to do in spots like that. How many of these games do you play in? I only play, uh, yes, yeah, this is my second one. Oh, okay. Yeah. You look, we're first, more fun than the first one. This one's more fun yeah. than the first one, but Jared right? was, you, Jaffe was in the first <laughs> one too. He was, he was, You're he was so fun. You're so excited. Oh, yeah. yeah, see. I'm on. Wow. This happened last time. Loose raise from ace five offsuit. The three bet from ace 10 offsuit. And Call twice. Haley looking to spin the wheel with yeah. jack 10. She's in bad shape here. Okay, fair. Two times. Haley going for it again with Jack 10 against the bigger 10. Uneventful flop. Nine? Okay. That's the thought of me. Need his card. <laughs> River seven. Christina Somewhere. takes round one. Yeah, I would have won this spot. No way I'm losing it. Second board. Okay. Oh, there's a jack in the window for Haley. Christina still alive with the gut mm. shot and the ace. She hit the ace. Which comes in. And Christina will take it. Fair game. And Haley Hannah will leave the table with nothing. It was nice playing with you. Now she's got a drink. Well, there was an abundance of action this evening, whether by cold deck or aggression. And when all was said and done, it was Jared Jaffe and Chrissy Foxen who were the sole profiteers from the table. Jared taking home nearly 26,000. Chrissy Foxen, in her poker night debut, booked about a 12K win. MJ Gonzalez joins the loser's bracket for the first time in six sessions. Christina McAlpin cracked a set early on, but then got coolered several times over to book a small loss. Christian Soto was the victim of a set over set stacking to begin the evening, which led to his $12,000 loss. And lastly, Haley Hanna may have played the most aggressive session in poker night history. She leaves stuck 20,000, but still up overall from a big win on her previous appearance. If you want more poker night, be sure to follow us on social media for highlights and exclusive hands of the day. Plus, you can find all our episodes and our 24 seven streaming channel on YouTube, Twitch, Plex, and many other services. Check PokerNight.com for details on where to watch. Also, don't forget to download our free poker app with regular sweepstakes contests, all new game modes like blackjack and slots, and it's all totally free. Search for us in your app store and download it today. For my co-host, Phil Galfon, and for everyone here at Poker Night in America in Studio 52, I'm Lon McCarran. Thanks for watching. Blood, huh? I'm out of my blood. I'm, I'm still down. I'm down by like 8K in this game. <laughs> I'm down like 8K in this game. You guys, you guys let, me, let me have my bluffs, okay? First off, let me have my bluffs, okay? I'm down. I'm down a ton. So let me let me try to get it back. And then uh, let me point it out to someone like Chrissy, who deserves <laughs> it, you know? Oh, very nice. You. I, I, <laughs> you're, you're 